We're gonna get troops on the ground. Yep, troops on the ground. What's up, what's up, Game Awards? Chief Rocky here with another episode of Rediscovering Imperion. And today we are going to do this whole signal logic thing. Uh, I went ahead and I pressed the P button. And it, <laughs> as you can see over here, it already uh, marked some of the uh, tasks complete. <laughs> Was not my intent. However, um, what I wanted to show you in the P menu. What I wanted to show you was the PDA. All right, so after we get done with these advanced topics, which is basically signal logic, right? Um, it's going to go into a base attack. So I'm hoping we could get through this and get into this base attack because it looks like it's going to be pretty, pretty interesting. Um, yeah. Ooh, it's going to give us a lot. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm looking forward to that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this. So it wants us to do a sensor crap, the sensor block. Uh, while we were not recording, I went ahead and collected some resources. Got some fuel built up. Okay, and I need to go to the blocks. Oh, here we go. And we want to do base. We're going to do two. Uh, because, again, while we were off. Find a suitable place where you could easily reach it. Okay. So we're going to put that one over here, actually. Actually, you know what? We'll put it over there. Mm. Anyhow, what I wanted to show you was... Uh, I had I have to do another one here. Another sensor. Uh, because I... Basically redid the base a little bit. Um, I put large... Four large, you see better here, four large solar power panels, but this entire day has either been rainy or foggy, so I'm about 100% sure they haven't done jack squat for us. Yeah, they ain't doing nothing. <laughs> they aren't doing nothing, so I'm going to go ahead and add this fuel real quick, which it might help. If I, uh, I'm not connected to the network. How could I not be connected to the network? There we go. We want to go consumables. Let's plop that in here. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on. And we get constructor out. So, boom. We should be good to go. Nice. Nice. 100%. What we'll do is we'll fuel this, this puppy up too. Whoa. Is it too much for you? Okay. I guess, I guess it's too much for him. Okay. Yes, I saw that. Thank you for letting me know a hundred times. Alright. Nope. We want to go consumables. Boom. There we go. So we got plenty of fuel for a while. All right. That stuff should... Why did I come back down there? Why Why do I keep going up there? That's the question. That's the question I should be asking. Okay. So. Let's go ahead and plop these down. So we're going to put this sensor here. We're gonna, I'm, I'm going to show you how to link it up afterwards. But this one's going to be a motion sensor. And then we're going to put the... Um, wants me to put it somewhere where we can reach it. Yes. Okay, so set correctly, lever should be able to switch your whole entire base on and off. Let's try it. Without power, your fridge are off as well. 
Okay, so what we're going to do here is it wants us to connect to our generator. And I'm going to right now show you the image of what it popped up when I completed the, la the, the last two parts of that message. Mission, blah, by accidentally clicking the P menu or hitting the P key or opening up. You know what I mean. Okay, so anyhow, we're going to go. Oh, that does nothing. Okay, so we're going to hit P on it. Okay, and that brings you to here. But once when you hit P and you're looking at the device, you hit devices and it takes you right to the lever. Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're going to go to signal logic. Okay, um, and we are going to add a circuit. We're going to name this circuit, actually. This is destroy, destroy. We don't need that because that was when we were taking it. <laughs> okay. So this signal logic name is actually, we don't even need this actually. We don't because we have the lever, right? And it's going to automatically add this. We don't need to add anything complicated here. And we're going to go ahead and base power. Something simple so we know what it means. Hit enter. Boom. Done. So now we're going to go to the generator. Okay. And you can see right here, we're going to look for base power. We're going to do follow. So as it's on, it's the generator's on. When the switch is off, the generator's off. Okay. Hit that. Now it's not off right now. We're going to cycle it. Boom. Done. Now it wants me to turn it off. Enemy forces. Okay, now I'll turn the bait off, base off, but the base is still on because we still have, okay. Your base is too close. And it was a, the chance is high that we will send troops to tear down your base. The more dangerous you, faction, the heavier the attack will be. The small attack force is coming your way. Make sure your turrets. You have three minutes. Oh, okay. So let me go make some ammo. Three minutes. That's actually not a lot of time if you think about it. Okay, we want 30 mil. We don't need that much. That should be good enough. We need 15. And let's get some rifle rounds. And some shotties. I think we're pretty much filled up. But it's always better to double check. Okay, yeah, we got plenty of that. Again, I'm doing this the hard way. <laughs> <laughs> I like I, I like going and check. Okay, we got plenty of that. So we have plenty of ammo, but it doesn't hurt to have some uh, being created. I just went and got some. Uh, we got copper too. Okay. This is a crappy day out too. Okay, so we got plenty of ammo, but I have ammo being made. Uh, I'm going to actually take some of the rifle rounds ah uh, we got plenty of rifle rounds yeah I think you know what I think we're gonna be okay I think we are going to be just fine and why I'm spreading the ammo out is just in case one of these boxes get destroyed we have coverage all around At least I'm hoping so. But I don't anticipate them getting destroyed. We want to go to constructor out. I don't want to know right there. Thank you. Okay, and we got yet more. We should get an alarm here in a minute. Check ammo and turrets. Okay, so I'm making ammo and that's what's making it happen. Okay, which is good. Yeah, we should be fine. It's, it's counting down. Okay, we're full there. Full there. Alrighty. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm giddy, bro. It's incoming. Whoa! They came out of nowhere. These are heavy too. Oh, he's. Where are you going? Where are you going? Right here. Right here. Don't, don't go 
my circles. Well done. Take care and destroy the command center of the enemy forces so that these base attacks will end. Open the control panel. Okay, so that was one base attack. Let's go get this stuff. That was underwhelming, to be honest with you. I was expecting, like, full-on ground troops. Very underwhelming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I left the area. Thank you. Let's grab some of this stuff, too. Nice. Plenty of goodies. Alright, let's get back there and check this P menu. Okay, back in here. Oh, here we go. Go to statistics tab, look at the base attack info card in the lower right. The base attack info will tell you which base from a certain faction is currently coordinating the attack. When this command center is destroyed, and given there are no multiple command centers, the attacks will end on this planet. On A01 Gamma, the command center is the Xerax. Uh, of the Xerax is Surdu Outpost. Head over there and destroy its core to end the attacks. Knowledge. If your base or capital vessel has at least a cloning chamber, clone chamber, or medic bay, open the, okay, instead of their home. Okay, we're going to do that. And you, a faction can have several command centers. Yes, we understand that. All right, so we're already in here. Let's go ahead and go, and I believe it's over here. Yes, home spawn. Done. And our battery still says zero. Grr. Grr, son. Grr. Hey, there's Pence. Hey, Mike Pence. You wanna, you wanna bring the sunshine out? <laughs> okay. So it wants us to head over there and attack these guys. You know what? Let's go ahead and do it. Um, let's make sure I get plenty of ammo. You know what? Uh, before we do that, I'm going to show you guys how to do this. So I put it down. Let's hit the P menu. Devices. This motion sensor right here is. Go I'm going to link this to the door. Okay. So we're going to door sensor or hanger. Mm, yeah. Bay sensor. Okay. So that's set. Let's go back to device. And we are going to do the interactive setup. Okay. So that is where it's sensing right now. And it gives you a little keypad over there. So let's move this around. It's not really doing anything. Oh, I have numlock on. Maybe I need maybe I need it on? Yes, I do. Okay, so that's not doing much. Hmm. I think I might have this thing backwards. Oh, enlarge control plus number pad. Okay, so we want to go backwards, I believe. Control. There we go. All right, gaming warriors. So right at this moment, for some reason, XSplit Broadcaster decided to stop working. It lost connection to the game. I don't know how. I don't know why. I troubleshot it. I got it fixed. But uh, I think you guys get the drift of how to set the sensing limits on the motion sensors. So let's carry on. Okay, well, we're getting ready to leave. And all of a sudden, the Xerax wanted to play. Yet again, oh god. This is, uh... Okay, this is what I was expecting. This is, this is what I was expecting. Come on, take him down, take him down, take him down, take him down. There's one, we get another one. Come on. Okay, we're gonna get troops. We're gonna get troops on the ground. Yep, troops on the ground.
Ooh, this is what I'm talking about. Ooh. Not that much damage you didn't do to me. Okay. I think you got all of them. Nope. He's close, too. Got him. <laughs> okay, now we prepare again. <laughs> Alright, Gaming Warriors, I believe I am much more well prepared than I was before, and we are going to fight. There it is, they already marked it for us. So we are heading up there to Surdu Outpost. I believe that's how you pronounce it. Let's get these Z racks up. Taste. Taste of Chief Rocky. There it is. I brought everything with us. I'm going to set up a camp too, just in case. I'm going to skip all this crap. We're getting kind of close. I don't know if they have turrets or anything. Okay, we already know they were in their territory. Okay. And we're going to walk from here. You know what? Let's go pick a another rock that's not radiated. How about that? No? Not working? There we go. Okay. It's not look. Okay. We're not radiated here. So that's where <laughs> we're setting up camp. Gosh darn it. Okay. Plop, plop, plop. I don't think... Yeah, I can't. Okay, we're going to have to do it this way then. I just want this stuff set up and ready to go. Just in case something bad happens. Which I don't, I don't anticipate happening. But. It's better to be ready than not ready at all. Okay, um, do I have everything I need out of here? So I'm going to grab all this stuff. I'm not sure what I'm going to need. I don't, I won't need O2. I don't want to drink the water. Just take a couple. Come on, dude. Ointments. Take it all. Take it all. Detox kits. And it's raining. Oh, perfect. Just what I asked for. Okay, I... I'll leave the drill there, just in case. Mm. Yeah. So, uh, you know, what? I get the pulse laser too, a pulse rifle. So, they, I got some weapons from that uh, those crashed, those two crashed troop transports, but nothing, nothing spectacular. Um, the minigun I have rounds for. Uh, I had rockets, but I sold them. Remember? Okay, so we gotta make sure that we get in here. Nice and stealthy like. Ooh, look at that lightning. We wanna skip the uh the raptors over there. Now I'm anticipating turrets. I'm not I'm not sure the extent of the turrets. So far, we're not taking fire. So I suspect just maybe anti-personnel. If they were bigger turrets, they would have probably fired on us by now. That's why I didn't bring the uh, the hovercraft in either. Is uh, was unsure of the turret situation. It says level one, so. But I'd rather not lose the hovercraft. Okay, I 
I don't see any turrets. Ah, oh, there's one. It's anti-personnel. So let's... Got him. There's another anti-personnel. Can I reach it? Looks like I can. Got it. Okay. Let's just go ahead and head in. to the door. I don't think I'm going to be able to open it this... Can I? Nope. Okay. There's baddies right there too. Uh, I can see them. Those are dogs. Okay. Let's get back here behind this little berm. Let's see if I can damage it with the uh, sniper rifle. find another way in guys whoa Turrets are done with. Okay. Maybe we can blast our way in through the top, huh? Maybe. Let's see. Nope. Uh, what did you say? Different map mode by clicking. Okay, let's try that. Nope. Nope. Say what? Those rockets would have came in real handy, by the way. I don't think I'm causing any damage to it. Nada. Urgh. This sucks. Hmm. You know what? I'm probably thinking I should have never, ever, 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 ever got rid of those uh rockets, by the way. Hmm. I think I, I think I'm gonna need explosives. Yep. Okay, guys. So I will be right back. I have to somehow find a way of getting a explosive to open this up. Be right back. All right, Gaming Wars. So I was able to get my hands on some explosive devices and some rocket launchers. What I did was I went back and I went to the Polaris and I purchased them since I have a crap ton of credits. I think over 3 million or 300,000, somewhere around there. Um, and since I know I defanged this thing, we're gonna go ahead and drive right up to the front door. No turrets, I'm not worried about it. We'll 
go ahead and link so that we, if we loot, which we are, of course, I could go ahead and grab this stuff. It's another crappy day, of course. This planet, this planet, man, I'm telling you. F4, Junker Cargo Box 2, done and done. Change this out. Okay, so uh, let's grab the rocket launcher out. So, again, they give you this rocket launcher, pretty much, um, and they give you rockets. So, <laughs> make sure you keep them. Make sure you keep them. I'm not going to need a sniper rifle right now. Okay, six rockets. Nice. Nice. Uh oh, not so nice. On the move. Got him. That was a shoddy too. We get another one coming. Got him. Paul's rifle is definitely less powerful, but yes, some laser rounds. But it is faster firing. Okay, we want to destroy that, and that's done. Ooh, that puppy moves fast. Oh, rounds we got left four. Okay. All right, we could destroy those at least. Something's up there, no? Okay. And I think this does something, but let's make sure we get all our kills in first. Oh yeah. I think we got them all. Nice. This base is pretty much ours. I believe this switch over here kills it. Or does it? I have no idea what I just did. <laughs> We're about to find out. Maybe it opens this up? I think it just turned it off. Yeah, it turned it off. So, we need to find a way in there to destroy. Okay, there's more baddies. I hear them moving. Okay, so there's another way in there. You know what? Let's see what the switch does. Does it open that? I don't think so. Okay, we could definitely gotta get in there. So let's go ahead and do that again. We gotta destroy those up there. Okay, something just opened. Oh, I could destroy your generators. Oh, I'm gonna leave those intact though. What does it say up here? That's <laughs> something an alien. Okay, um, got two rockets left. I don't think that's gonna do the job. So let's go ahead and use these. Okay. Yep, I saw turrets. <laughs> Maybe in hindsight I shouldn't have done it like that, but I got this bad boy right here.
Take heavy damage. <laughs> Got him. Okay. I think that's everybody. Any more? Okay. We are good to go. What does this bad boy do? He does something. He does something. I think he gives me access to this. Yes. Yes, it does. Nice. Okay, so what we're going to do here... Throw all this and jump. Nice. Perfect. Big loot, guys. Big loot. Big loot. Well, for me. <laughs> At least. <laughs> okay. So the core is right there. Upgrades. Ooh. There's a lot of stuff down there to loot, too. So let's... Get all this looted. More stuff right there. Little snake dude right here. Um, I can we blow him up and get down there? I don't know. Or I pulled everything out of there, right? Okay. Let's try this. Back up. Nice. That should do it. All right. Well, the Polaris definitely came in handy in this one. <laughs> nice. Captain Hyde speaking. Well done, Ensign. You destroyed the Xerox Command Center, but I'm afraid we need to retreat from this position nevertheless. This planet is no longer safe. The evacuation will start when our troops have arrived. Get yourself a small vessel and come up here. Okay. So let's go ahead and loot the rest of this stuff. Uh-oh. There are several ways to build a small, uh, build a base or a vessel. Uh, cross starter block, blah, blah, blah. Find a damaged vessel or base. Put your own core and look at that. Blueprint library faction. We will use the latter variant. Create a small vessel that has the one that has the one and only job of bringing you up to the UCH station. Open the blueprint to F2. Okay, so we are going to do that in the next video. Let's go ahead and loot the rest of the stuff and get the hell out of here. <laughs> yes. Look at that. Titanium rods too. Nice. Oh, the loot. The loot. There was something here, I think. No? Lots of goodies. Nice. Definitely have enough to create whatever the hell we want. Nice. Definitely a lot of stuff. I think some of the stuff we could go sell too. Another loot box. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, that's a tier two assault rifle. Yes, we're good. We are good. And those are just. Yep, we're good. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of Dodge. Did I get this one around? I did. Okay. And we are heading back to base, guys. All right, Gaming Warriors, we got quite a bit of loot. All right, some neodymium ingots, uh, uh, titanium rods. We got a whole bunch of boosts plus another medium armor. I believe we're wearing light, so this medium armor will definitely provide us another boost. Um, iron ingots, uh, a huge stack of cobalt. We got quite a bit of stuff. So this is, yeah, I think we're going to be set. So we're going to end it here. Uh, in the next video, we're going to go ahead and build ourselves or... 
spawn a small vessel from the blueprint factory <laughs> and go from there. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's all I got. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell for more excellent Imperium content just like this. Chief Rocky out. Thank you.